Hey guys, Carlo here. Welcome to the vlog. In today's episode, we're going to answer the question, should you buy the Nike Air Max 270 React? Boop! Before we get started, let me just give a quick shout out to the sponsor of today's video, Digital Walker. Digital Walker is one of the best electronics and gadget stores that you guys can get your devices from. Be it smartphones such as brands such as like OnePlus or even headphones and speakers from brands such as Marshall. They carry a lot of products, a lot of brands, so there's definitely something there for you. Check them out. Digital Walker, I will put links down below to their page on Lazada and Shopee. In this video, I'll answer the question both ways. Yes, you should buy it. No, you shouldn't buy it. Let's start with the yes. Yes, you should buy the Nike Air Max React 270 if you are looking for fun, versatile sneakers that you can change up every now and then. Why? Because if you take a look at the new colorway of the Nike Air Max React 270, the upper is actually translucent or transparent here at the foot area as well as the panels on the medial and the lateral side of the shoe. And anytime you have a transparent sneaker, it means that you can make it change a bit depending on the socks that you wear. So let's say you want to keep it subtle. You want to conform to the flesh color of the sneaker. Then you wear, you know, well, socks that conform to the color something like beige sand or cream but let's say you want to make it pop you want to make it different then you can probably go with like dark blue socks to be able to accent or contrast with the light blue laces you can even make it all orange so that it actually syncs with the orange material or orange color here at the toe as well at the heel of the shoe you can even change out the laces i'm currently using the teal laces but it also comes with white laces so if you're looking for fun vibrant versatile sneakers check should also might want to consider it if especially when it comes to comfort you are light to medium build when you are light to medium build the air bubble here at the back combined with the react technology of the forefoot should give you enough stability cushioning and heel support but please take note that it's that particular body weight that I've noticed that works well more with this particular sneaker. I will talk about how it is for bigger sized people when it comes to the no part of this vlog. Yes, also, if you are looking for sneakers that will turn heads, because most of the colorways available, there are two of them for men, are really loud shoes. These are sneakers that will turn heads. These are sneakers that will grab attention. If you're looking for subtle, quiet sneakers, these aren't a chief, so you might want to consider other more subtle shoes. Yes, also, if you have budget to spare, because they are pricey. They sell for over 7,600 pesos, and please do take note that they are casual lifestyle sneakers. You can cannot use them for working out you cannot use them for going to the gym because the air bubble doesn't give enough support at least in my opinion you're better off buying more athletes or performance type sneakers for that situation let's get to the no no you shouldn't buy the nike air max react 270 if you are on a tight budget i have a strong feeling that we will be seeing different colorways of this flood the market as we've seen with the presto react and the previous React and Air Max 270 sneakers and even the 720s. So you, you're kind of sure that we will see this on discount in the next few months or maybe even see it sitting on the outlet store come wise, maybe six, seven months from now. So if you can wait, then you can probably save on your cash. But if you can't wait and you really, really fell in love with the sneaker and you want it, then now's your chance to be able to buy it. But again, you're paying full retail. No, you shouldn't buy it if you are looking for sneakers that are made from the best quality, especially when it comes to the upper, best materials for the upper. If you take a look at this particular colorway, which is the Bauhaus, uh, the, that suede isn't suede. It's actually some sort of like cheap felt paper type material, which really doesn't give enough premiumness especially if you touch it i mean it looks nice from a distance it looks nice if somebody's looking at it but once you touch it you know that it's really not that premium and it is cheap material speaking of material make sure to avoid the bauhaus if you hate bleeding colors because the blue lining inside the shoe actually bleeds on the white a uh, tongue tab that you guys see here i've seen it several times it's actually happened on this sneaker so just a word of caution that's the problem that you will face with the bauhaus colorway no you shouldn't buy the sneaker if you are big build like me 
and you are looking for the most comfortable lifestyle sneaker that you guys can pick up today. I just felt that the heel uh, combined with the react of the forefoot didn't give me enough support and stability, something that I would usually find with the Presto React or even the 720s or the 270s. I think it's how the sneaker is built. However, please do take note that when I did go a half size up with this shoe, it felt so much more comfortable, but there was still that heel like fatigue after several hours of wear, something that I don't get when I wear Air Force Ones or when I wear Ultra Boosts or even Reacts, other, other types of React sneakers. Also, you should avoid this like the plague if you're looking for sneakers that can work well during the rainy season, especially here in the Philippines because it is storm season. You're better off going for the Nike Air Max 270 Bowfin. This one is actually water resistant, the upper as well as that generous outsole that you see here for added traction and durability. Best thing about this one, guys, it's actually already in the outlets at 30% off in different colors selling for a little over 5,000 pesos. So not only is it cheaper, but it actually offers more function compared to the Air Max 270 React. So those are the reasons why you should or why you shouldn't buy the Air Max 270 React by Nike. At the end of the day, it is a fashionable, trendy, versatile, vibrant, head-turning sneaker that's comfortable if you are medium to light build. I think I got that correctly. And if you love playing around with socks, you might as well go for this one with the transparent upper. Before we end the vlog, let me just remind you that we have a bunch of ongoing giveaways, guys. We're giving away an Oppo A5S. We're giving away a Redmi Note 7. We're giving away the Clay Thompson Anta East Bay Times collaboration sneaker. Only 200 of that in existence. We're giving away the Jollibee Funko Pops. We're giving away so much stuff. And I'm going to add more to that as the days go by. So make sure that you guys are subscribed. Make sure that you follow me on Instagram. Make sure that you join our Facebook community. The details of which can be found in the description box. That's it for now. I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. Peace. God bless. What's up? Boom.